Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rain and I am back with Chunga Everyone Everybody Has. Um a lot of Chunga's songs seem to be fairly upbeat, but the like tiny snippets and pictures I've seen of this music video um really don't look like that. They don't look like that kind of song, but she has got quite a versatile voice. Um and she's got the kind of voice that can turn easily to different styles. I think I haven't listened to a lot of her stuff that isn't release. Um, mostly because um, she came out, of, obviously she came out into everyone's notice through Produce 101 and I really didn't keep up with Produce 101. I haven't kept up with any of them. Um, and so it was only kind of like clicking through random videos that I even came across her release stuff. Um, so I'm, I'm not an expert. I don't really know a lot about her. I know that she was in the Bang Bang performance um, and obviously I know she got into IOI. That's like my knowledge. Um, but yeah, let's, let's give this a try. That was an awkward smile. I feel like that right now. Ooh, definitely more ballady. Is this like an OST for something or something? No, it doesn't have the feel of that. Just a ballad. Definitely showcasing her amazing voice though. thing with ballads that I just I don't enjoy them as much like I, I said this I think in as one her voice is amazing but it's just um, not really my flavor I've also realized quite how loud my headphones are today and this is really loud at the moment for me which is just reinforcing how useful the voice is but I want to be in the forest and in nature, locked in my room. Seems to picked up a bit, like more hopeful than like sad. Also, like a different elevation. You know, it feels good. Okay, here comes the sad part. There's always the sad part in a ballad. I, I know that's part of the genre of ballads. I, I do understand that, but that's kind of the bit that puts me off, I think. Yeah, 
Yeah. It, it's always a tricky one with a ballad because it's not a genre I listen to outside of this kind of like listening to releases and stuff like that. Um, it does become more of a kind of appreciation of the actual voice or the music video or whatever it is that I'm watching it for. Um, nobody has a doubt that Chung Ha has an amazing voice. She has a beautiful voice. It's it's versatile in the fact that it can be put to different beats and paces. It's not kind of one of those, you get some people with those kind of like very melodic voices that struggle to go into kind of pop music. Um, and as, as beautiful as I think that was, it just is not, it's not a genre at all. Like this is nothing against Chunga. This is nothing against anybody else who's ever made a ballad. Um, it's purely my taste to have more kind of upbeat songs, m more, I'd love to say positive, but there are plenty of songs on my uh, my playlist that are not necessarily positive or upbeat songs, but definitely kind of more lively. Um, and so for me, it's always going to be a no for a ballad, but that, that definitely was amazing. Like, I wasn't let down by anything that she did. Like, her voice is fantastic and nobody will ever take that away from her, no matter what kind of genre she is doing. So yeah, that's my opinion and I'll see you all soon. Bye.